Hi, I'm Hojan. Today, I want to demonstrate quality laboratory measurement, test, and essay. The objective of this experiment is to determine the accuracy, position, percentage error, standard deviation, and coefficient of variation for various volumetric as well as using different balance. But in this video, I will use digital balance to show you the step. So, let's begin. First, install the digital balance at a flat and steady surface and make sure you have the result table to record the reading. Now, switch on the digital balance. If you see any zero error like this, don't worry, we can just press the T button so it's set to zero. Now put an empty container on the digital balance so we can know the width of the container. So the empty container is 28 gram. I forget to tell you the reading unit in the display is in gram. Now take out the empty container from the digital balance and put again the empty container on it. So it showed 28 again. So that means the first reading of the empty container is 28 gram and the second reading also is 28 gram. Second, measure 100 ml of water by using a measuring cup. Let me put my hand so you can see the scale clearly. Now pour the water into the measuring cup and make sure your eye is perpendicular to the scale reading. We have to slow down and carefully pour the water when it almost reached 100 ml. Turn on the digital balance and put the empty container on it. Then we pour the 100 ml of water that measure by using a measuring cup. The reading show is 129 grams for the first reading. Now remove the water from the container and put the empty container back to the digital balance and measure again the water by using measuring cup. Now pour 100ml of water that measure by a measuring cup to the empty container. And again, we get 129 grams. So we record the reading. Then remove the water from the container and switch off the digital balance. Third, I was using a tumbler to measure 100ml of water. Repeat the same process as we measure the water by using a measuring cup. Now turn on the digital balance and put an empty container on it. Now pour 100ml of water that measure by a tumbler. The reading show on the display is 124 gram for the first reading. Now we remove the water from the container, put the empty container on the digital balance. and pour 100ml of water that measure by a tumbler for the second reading. So, it show again the reading is 124 grams, so we record it at, at the second reading. Then, remove the water from the container, turn off the digital balance so we can proceed with steel container. Last but not least, I will measure 100ml of water by using a container with steel. Turn on again the digital balance and put an empty container on it. Then we pour 100ml of water that measure by a steel container. Record the reading as first reading. Now remove the water from the container and put the empty container back to the digital balance. Measure again 100ml of water by using the steel container. Now, pour 100ml of water that measure by scale container to the empty container. As we can see, the reading show on the display is 142 grams. So, we record it in the second reading. Then, we remove the water from the container and switch off the digital balance. Proceed with calculation of mean standard deviation, relative standard deviation, coefficient of variations. So that's all for today's video, thanks for watching, if you like this video please give me a like, bye bye.